health and safety when you're out on the street. Yeah, it's pretty important. But in a laboratory, it's vital. Labs are full of hazards. You don't have to be a scientist to realise that. So why do accidents still happen? Because people don't listen. What? They don't listen. Listen to what? The instructions. What is that? Obviously Bart Simpson. So before you cook up something crazy in a lab, there's a few basic common sense rules that you need to follow. Wear sensible shoes. Flip-flops or heels won't protect your feet if you drop chemicals or anything heavy on them. Wear a lab coat and keep it fastened. This stops it getting caught in anything and also hides your bad choice in jumpers. Wear gloves if you need to and keep safety goggles over your eyes, not on top of your head. Chemicals and eyes are a bad mix. If you've got long hair, make sure it's tied back well out of the way from anything sharp, fiery or chemically. Your hair won't like any of these things. Always, always wash your hands before leaving the lab. Keep any traces of chemicals in the lab, not on your fingers. Laboratory Zen teaches us that a tidy work area is a tidy mind. It also means that you don't put your hands in anything corrosive. So wipe up any spills and make sure you... In a lab, you can't just put everything in the same bin. Some things just don't mix. Use the right bin for whatever you're throwing away. Listen to what the lab technicians say and make sure you do what they tell you. They've been working in labs for a long time, so they're telling you to do stuff for a reason. It's very important to take health and safety seriously when working in a lab. A lab contains much more hazards than any normal classroom, so it's got a much greater risk. If you're unsure about anything at all, just ask a member of staff.